In today's video, we are going to be unboxing and reviewing the Insta360 ONE X2. Out of all the Insta360 models, this is by far the most selling one. This camera was released on October 27, 2020 as the successor to the ONE X. The company was founded in 2015 by Arashi Vision Inc. Limited. This company has its origin in China. Talking about this device, of course you will need to buy the stick separately. Inside the box you get the device, the protective pouch, the battery, USB Type-C charging cable, warranty card, quick start guide and you also get stickers with Insta360 branding and a cleaning cloth. You only get a cable and not the plug or charger inside. The ONE X2 is IPX8 waterproof for up to 10 meters deep and if you buy the dive case then you can go as deep as 45 meters. The company claims that the 1630 mAh battery of ONE X2 is 55% more powerful than the ONE X. On the ONE X2 there are two cameras to give you the 360 degrees of view and it has its own inbuilt microphone. Now there are some different types of sticks compatible with this but I will always suggest you to go with the largest stick out there as it will do the function of drone as well. Insta360 ONE X2 is for people that want drone like footage but don't want to carry the hassles associated with a drone. This Insta360 supports 5.7K 360 degree capture but I will suggest you to stick with the 4K 50 frames per second because with the 5.7K you will only get the 30 frames per second, the maximum. The camera's aperture is f2.0 and the device weighs 150 grams. You can choose the ISO white balance as well as the exposure levels but I will advise you to stick to the auto mode as it does a fairly decent job. For micro SD card, it is recommended that you get the UHS-1 V30 speed class at least. I personally use the SanDisk A2 class and it ran very smoothly. However, it will support the old capacity cards as well. But it is recommended that you opt for the fastest. It supports up to 1TB of SD card storage, but you wouldn't need anything about 256. The device can be connected to both the Android and the iOS device, but I personally found the experience on the iPhone a lot more smoother. However, there are some down points with the iPhone as I could not export the videos above the 30 frame per second, while in the Android the performance may be laggy, but it does offer higher frame rates and plenty of other options. ONE X2 captures everything at the touch of a button, you don't have to worry about pointing the camera, just pick your favorite angles later in the Insta360 app. You can also have the option to export videos in different aspect ratios. In terms of the compatibility, you can pair this with the iPhone higher than 8, iPhone SE 2, all iPad models. I personally tested this on iPhone 13 Pro and it was a very smooth experience. For Android, it supports Snapdragon 845 and above chips. The gyroscope is 6 axis, you can adjust the screen brightness, turn off the audio and lock the screen. Everything is touch screen and the device heats up, you may get fingerprints on the lenses and the screen. It uses the flow state stabilization technology and trust me you will not need to edit the videos for stabilization as the inbuilt stabilization does the perfect job. The Bluetooth connectivity is BLE 4.2, the recommended use environment is minus 20 degrees Celsius to 40 degrees Celsius and this thing will get heat up if you make long recording above the 40 degrees Celsius outside the house. You can also do the 360 degree live stream on both Facebook as well as YouTube. In the end of the video, I'll show you the sample clips recorded with it, with the audio coming from its own microphone. And if you want to buy this from Amazon, I will leave the link of it in the description.